Hey y'all, so I'm going to start off with this Urban Decay eyeshadow primer and I'm putting this on both of my lids. Okay, so now I'm using the color Warm Taupe in the Modern Renaissance palette and I'm just going to put that all over my lid. Next, I'm going to take the red ochre color and I'm going to put that right on top of the warm taupe color. But I'm going to put the majority of it on the outer part of my lid and just blend it inwards. Next, I'm taking this brown color here. And I'm just going to go over my crease with that color just to give a little bit more depth. I'm taking the color sketch this is a MAC pot and I'm going to put that on the outer part of my lid and then I'm going to pack that on the inner part of my lid also leaving the center blank I'm taking this really really pretty eyeshadow from Urban Decay. This is called Midnight Cowboy. And I'm going to pack that in the center. Okay, so now with this brush, I'm going to go ahead and go back in my crease with the color Sketch by MAC. And I'm doing this because to me, it looked a little bit better as far as the halo eye is concerned. So I just went ahead and put a little bit of that in my crease just so it can look a little bit more unified. Now I'm taking this lighter shade right here and I'm going to highlight my eyebrow bone with this. Okay, so here I'm just going back in with that red color because I lost a little bit of it when putting on the other eyeshadows and I also wanted to blend out the highlight a little bit and now I'm putting on some of my primer for my foundation. Okay, and now I'm going to put on a little bit of this professional primer just because my pores are kind of large and I want to cover them a little bit more and then I'm going to mix the two foundations I showed you and just apply that to my face. taking my LA Girl Pro Concealer and I'm just going to apply that under my eyes, my chin, my nose, my forehead. going back in with a sketch and putting it on the bottom lash line. Now I am going back with my eyeliner pencil and just lining both of my bottom lash lines again. And 
And of course, don't forget to apply some mascara to your top and bottom lash lines. Then I am going to do a little bit of contouring. This is the ColourPop stick and it is in the color type O. Now I'm taking my handy dandy Laura Mercier translucent powder and just carving out the cheekbones a little bit better. And then I'm also going to go ahead and set my face, like my under eyes, and basically all the places I highlighted with the concealer. Next, I'm taking this really pretty, pretty, my favorite blush I have, and this is from Sephora. I'm just gonna put that on my cheekbones. Now I'm taking this ColourPop blush and I'm just going to go over the Sephora one just to add a little bit more shine and glow to my face. Next I'm taking this Becca highlight and just putting that on the very top of my cheekbones and my nose, my lip, my chin, my forehead, all those good places. And then I'm going to wipe off all the excess Laura Mercier powder. Now I'm going to take the NYX Liquid Suede Lipstick and I'll put the color in all the other products I used down below in the description box. And this is my final look. I really hope you guys liked it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.